My name is Ruth Koyet. I'm from Kenya. I was uh, diagnosed with, with uh, a type of blood cancer called multiple melona. So I did my treatment in Kenya from May last year up to October. And then after that, my doctor advised me to do a, a, mo a bone marrow transplant. So I asked the doctor where I can do the bone marrow transplant, the, the countries. So she told me I can do it in uh, South Africa, India, uh, Germany, or UK, or, or America. So I chose to come to India. I started studying the hospital here in India. So I got a, a hospital called uh, Yoshuda because uh, I read the doctor's profile. Dr. Ganesh is my doctor. So, and he has done over 60 transplants ever since. That's why I decided to come here and I was also introduced by a gentleman called Joshua, whom I knew and some of my friends in Kenya knows him. So I chose to come here. So after I reached here in November, I started with a test before I did now the transplant. They checked so many things, the blood, the organs, everything, whether everything was okay with me and everything was normal. So from there, I was uh, admitted on uh, November 19th, so uh, ready to do the transplant. So after that, uh, the transplant was done, I was put in isolation for about uh, 10 days. So uh, my 10th day after my 10th day, I, I, I was okay. All the white blood cells started responding. And then, I, in fact, the, when the doctor came in the morning, he told me that, Ruth, you are doing so, so well and your transplant is successful. I, I got a shock because before I came, I, I was told that uh, transplants take 25 days to 30 days. And mine, mine responded the 10th day. So the next day the doctor comes and tells me, Ruth, I'm going to discharge you. You are okay, so you can stay around for another few weeks to be able uh, for review. So from there, I stayed here for one month for review. I kept coming to hospital every week and doing blood tests just to check whether I'm okay and I'm okay. So I've not had any problem. I've not even had any side effect after I left hospital. And uh, I really appreciate it. and I, I also thank God because it is also through prayers. I know my friends back at home are praying and everyone else is praying. And we thought we've also been praying. And also, I, my transplant went well because of the doctors and the nurses that were surrounding me and my, my daughter. I came here with my daughter and everything was okay. It went on well and um, I, the services here are very, they are good, very good. They are perfect. The nurses, they are there 24 hours. Even the doctors, they are always ca coming like three times, three times a day or four times. They come with so many doctors, not one doctor, Dr. Ganesh and their associates. Okay, another thing I would like to add, the hospital services are good. They have uh, the latest modern machines and the nurses are good, they are well trained and even the doctors, because I was seeing Dr. Ganesh is the main one and he has some associate doctors, but he's the main person. So it, it was wonderful. I had the best time here. And I, I think that's why I even got uh, well fast. Yeah, so what I would uh, tell everybody, whoever has a problem with a transplant, I would love, I would tell you to, to come to Yoshida Hospital. It is the best, one of the best hospitals.